Hey Dolly friends, happy pride and happy Gemini season to all the Geminis. This is Callie Stormdoll here and today we're jumping into the world of Monster High. We do have the exclusive RuPaul Dragon Doll, yes. This is an exclusive to Mattel Creations. This was a release um, on Mattel Creations website that does run for $50 USD. But if you hurry over to Amazon, you could maybe scoop it up. But for the scalpers, raise the price past $50. We're going to jump into her recap. I also have the Lady Gaga doll. So we're going to look her over, compare them, unbox Rue, get into their fashions. Yes, yes, yes. Hello, everyone. It's me, Lady Gagath, and I'm here to present tonight's performer of the Eclipse Awards. Yes, we do have a performance for the one, the only, Mother Roo. Yes, give it to him real. Right, so here we have Rue out of the packaging, and as you can see, I did take off the boots, so let's take a look at those. I love these boots. As you can see, there are like vines wrapped around the boots. There are teeth right up front. It is like an iridescent black. You have the dragon scales all over it, and the boots are identical, but I'm going to show you the other one anyway. For the sake of the review, how is everyone doing today? Like the video, share the video, and subscribe. I'm just going to give you an overview of Mother Roo. Yes. Mother Roo should come to the school as a teacher, not a student. But we're going to do the read-up. We're going to check the read-up. And just so you know, um, Mother Roo does have a hairnet on. Okay? So if anyone can see that she does have a hairnet on. This is the drapery of it all. And you can see the drapery does go down. So I'm going to turn Rue around. And we're going to check out Rue. But I want you to look in the back. Now look, this is the read up. You know, I haven't been on a channel for a minute. So I'm going to do y'all a favor. I'm going to read it. This says, this is the moment legends become reality. As the moon glides until the earth shadows. Beyond the RuPaul Dragon Queen awakening and rise from the ashes, embracing the duality of light and darkness. The Queen's crimson colored amulet is activated, silent no more. The fierce Queen gives a voice to the dragon as the keeper and beholds the world's goddess energy meets dragon fire and beckons a bold new era of enlightenment. And it's time of harmony to embody strength and vulnerability, vulnerability, <laughs> and to unleash the power within and let it shine. All hail the RuPaul Dragon Queen doll. Go off, Sister Ru. Yes. Okay. Now RuPaul is on a larger body than a typical Monster High doll, and we will be looking at that as well. Now this, you can see RuPaul's makeup. RuPaul looking good. On the side, you can see the dragon scales. It was supposed to be a little bit more scaly, but it's printed on scales. You can see it is on both sides. I just love this. I had to get this doll, not only because it's RuPaul and it's Pride Month, but when do we ever get really unique sculpts? It's been so long. And I just was so interested. Look at the high cheekbones, the teeth. It is giving me a little bit Claudine older sister, but not as smiley smiley. I'm just happy to get a new face sculpt in the Monster High universe. I love that the ears are sculpted on. I love the earrings. The headpiece looks good. And the hair is vivid white. Okay. This is a French tap. So you see this white tap? Look at the hair compared to that tap. That's how white it is, okay? It looks good. Now, I ain't going to take the cap off because I'm going to sit Rue back in a box. I took Rue out for this review. You know, your homegirl moving. So, you know, I did bring it out just for the sake of the review. But look. Look at the wings. The wings are detachable. You see that? Look, it's like a harness. Rue does have the neck piece. This is all connected, okay? So if you just want the choker, you can't. It's all connected. I love these snake charms. Oh, these dragons. I love these dragon um bracelets on RuPaul's arms. These are the nail hands, you can see. And on this arm, there is a bracelet that says RuPaul. So you'll never forget your doll's name. 
Also, you can look at the face and say, looks a little bit like Rue, you know. Underneath, we have the bathing suit. And the top and bottom is separate, surprisingly. So the bottoms are separate from the top. That's cool. So this black top is a separate piece. And this sheer piece is all one piece. You see that? Look at this in the back. Underneath the wings. Yeah, they just kind of threw this around. Um, That's kind of cheap. But maybe they didn't think people were going to take it out the box. But underneath, you can see this goes down all the way to the bottom. It has glitter and stuff on the back. But on the inside, it is basic black. And the stockings don't go all the way down. So far, I'm seeing $33.99. I'm not seeing $50 yet, okay? Now, I do want to show this to you. And when I was in a car, I actually took some notes and I wrote this down. I said, stand lackluster. Nothing exclusive to Rue. Too basic for $50. I couldn't believe it because look. This is the stand we get. Now, look, I will tell you this. I'm thankful that we got something. Yes, I am. But if this is going to be a one-time RuPaul collaboration with Mattel, like, this is big. The only other dog company I know Ru has collaborated with is Integrity Toys. So the fact that Ru has, you know what I mean? It's a big deal to me. I would think maybe we could have an exclusive stand or something like that. That would have bumped it up the extra 20 bucks. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just going to slide Ru's boots back on. And then I'm going to bring over um, my Lady Gaga doll. Because I'm not sure if I've ever recapped her on a channel. I may have gotten Lady Gaga prior to having a recap channel so you know there's that but i did take off oh i wanted to show you this i took off her shoes um i got her when she was exclusive to toys r us when we had a toys r us i got her she was only 30 she was like 29.99 now i wish i would have wrapped too but it's cool this is her and i took her shoes off because i wanted to show you the height so i'm gonna take her shoe off again Without shoes on, they aren't that, you know, different in height. So Lady Gaga is straight up and down, and then RuPaul hips bellows out on the sides. So that's the difference. One is curvy than the other one. But this is a cool way so you guys can see my Lady Gaga doll. You see Lady Gaga walking down the street. Lady Gaga, who you want to meet is Gaga's. Yeah. So Lady Gaga doll was a zombie. Because you know that's what she was about at the time. She still might be real zombie like. But yeah, look at her hands and stuff. Lady Gaga's. Yes. I do have her original jumpsuit and all her pieces. But I was playing dress up one day. So she got dressed up. So I'm kind of happy. I know this video was not about, Ru I mean, it wasn't about Gaga. It was all about RuPaul. But I was going through my old Monster High stuff and I actually found Lady Gaga's um, outfit from the original pack. And I think I'm going to dress her up in it. And then I'm going to reintroduce her to Rue. Yes. I really did think I had lost this stuff. Because sometimes when, um, you know, you're changing your Monster High doll clothes, they get lost. But I And now over here we have RuPaul. Now let's look at the likeness. Look like they're celebrity counterparts. As far as um, Rue looking like Rue, yes. I love the brown eyes. I love it all. Now Lady Gaga, yes. I think they look just alike. I love that Monster High is into adding celebrities. Okay, Monster High, I have a request. And this is from Cali Storm Dolls. Can we get a Monster High and Lil' Kim collaboration? Come on. Come on. It's time for Monster High to meet one of the hip-hop girlies. Yes! If not Lil' Kim, um, my alternative is Sweetie. Can we get Sweetie goes to Monster High? I think that will make a cute doll. Yes. But you all comment below. What do you think about um, these Monster High Mattel creation dolls? Were you able to snag up RuPaul? What do you think about RuPaul, the original dragon queen in the collection? And also, if you do have the Lady Gaga Monster High doll, what did you think about her? And how do you feel about celebrity students going to the school? I mean, they're monsters too, right? <laughs> comment below i like how lady gaga's monsters are the little monsters so she's a zombie and rupaul did a flip on the word dragon which they call drag queens and became a doll you know what i'm saying gotta love it i want to thank you all for tuning in today and thank you for spending time with me like the video share and subscribe let me know your thoughts on these dolls today as i will return with another recap
I'll see you in the next one. Why didn't we get an invitation? Mm. They thought they could keep us out because we're different. <sighs> it's time for the monsters to rise. Mm -hmm.